Hello guys, welcome to my channel, David Madison the Guardian. I am the Guardian, I'm a Jedi practicing now for about three years. What you see in front of you is uh, just like a fast food bag, a cone, and uh, so one of the things you can do is get it so it doesn't have a lot of friction, play with it a little bit. As, as you practice balancing it, um, what happens to me is I start feeling the energy gathering around me. Um, I start feeling inside my brain that it's kind of wobbling. Okay, drop down. breaths. I'm sinking the weight. I'm feeling like even my buttocks dropping down into my legs. It's physical grounding. Physical and fascial, I would say like grounding, causing the fascia to kind of relax and sink downwards. Now I'm sending my consciousness down through my legs, down through my feet, down through the earth, imagining that I'm connecting to the core, the molten core of the earth, magma, which is electromagnetic in nature. It's super hot, um, gaseous, um, so lots of energy and lots of thick energy. Then I'm imagining sending my intention up to like where the clouds are. We can start there. And kind of connecting with the top of my head and even like the chakras that are above the head. bring those two energies together in my body. They spiral down in. As you see, the energy is picking up, so this bag is having a harder and harder time to stay up here. We can flip it over. Okay. So now I'm bringing the energies down As it passes through the chakras, okay, it's going to pick up those energies. It's like a white light and it passes through each chakra, right, and it picks up a color, and mixes that, and mixes that. It's going to come down kind of my chest area. It's also coming down my spine. I just figured out something and I didn't realize this. The spine isn't at the center of the body. It actually is further, further back. So you have the middle part line, the gravitational line of the body. You have the spine that does that weird S curve. And then you have the front of the body. And every chakra is kind of three points, front, middle, and back. So I'm gonna pass through the chakra center points and there's also lines of energy that are on the sides of the spine going this way as well okay so you bring in like a column of energy twisting it down the body we're twisting the energy up through the body from the bottom and they're gonna kind of meet in the solar plexus area, okay, that's uh, navel solar plexus area, and then I'm gonna take that energy and drop it 
and place it like in the second, um, in the lower Dantian, which is like right around the second chakra. And it's going to stretch across the first chakra and the second chakra, okay? I'm, I'm stretching that energy like this. And then I'm kind of trying to pull it closer and closer and closer together. And that causes like a negative and a positive. It causes electricity. And then I'm going to... And then I'm gonna kind of like spin that energy and shoot it back up the body. It's gonna go through the chakras again, through the sides of the body, through the center of the body, through the back and the front of the body and through the center this way. But it's spiraling and it's spiraling like around the center of my body and maybe around the spine. When it reaches the heart, it's gonna charge the heart like a like a dynamo, right? And then I'm gonna send it out through my arms. But I'm also doing this thing. At least this is what I'm tr I'm trying to practice. I'm doing what's called the microcosmic orbit, which is energy drops down this way tucks under the tailbone, comes up the backside, and goes back down. That's the microcosmic orbit. And so that energy is going to come up right around back here and here, and then branch out through the arms, along with the heart now being energized and the brain's energized. And then when I take those two fields, when they come together, the heart and the brain creates this bubble of electromagnetism of the aura. I also imagine that there's a toroidal field around me so that energy is scooping up and through like this it's coming in but it's also going out the bottom and it's coming in and also going out the top so there's actually two spirals happening that are in opposite directions there's also a spiral which i i haven't figured out how to do yet but it's it like either goes like this or it goes kind of like this. That's it for this video. I just wanted to go a little bit more in detail to the process of developing an energetic connection with psychokinesis and telekinesis. Uh, peace and be well, my friends. Till next time, like, subscribe, and share. Thanks.